they have destroyed. <laughs> my foundation for morality, for values, for trust. The pain never goes away. Joe Icona was 11 years old when he says he was abused by his parish priest. His name is one of 395 Catholic clergy and laypersons listed in a report compiled by church sex abuse victims attorney Jeff Anderson. Uh, the purpose of this report is to disclose the scope of the peril that the Catholic bishops have chosen not to disclose and keep secret. Anderson says the names come from all six Illinois dioceses. He says the list are clergy and lay people who have been publicly accused. The Archdiocese of Chicago admits it has not released the names of 22 priests on Anderson's list because the Archdiocese says they are unsubstantiated allegations. These names are not secret. There was no effort to conceal them. They were all reported to authorities. The Archdiocese says all allegations are reported to police. Despite that, victims' attorneys say in most cases by the time it's reported, the statute of limitations has run out and it's too late to charge someone. Attorneys say that doesn't mean a crime was not committed. If they're relying on law enforcement, and if law enforcement chooses not to charge, if that's what they're basing, whether something is substantiated or not substantiated, I would say, um, that's not appropriate and they're using the wrong standard. The Archdiocese of Chicago is considering listing publicly some or all of the 22 names listed in Jeff Anderson's report. The Archdiocese says the majority of the names are priests who are already deceased. And with the exception of the 22, the church points out Anderson's report is a compilation of names that have already been publicly disclosed, usually through lawsuits, et cetera. And the other dioceses say the same thing, that a lot of these names have already been out there. It is hard. Hey, if you like that video, be sure to subscribe to our ABC7 Chicago YouTube channel.